Hi, I'm Dr. Harry Smith. I am a retired bartender from Las Vegas, Nevada where I worked the bartending circuit from 2000 to 2020 at one time or another I worked just about all the arenas in Las Vegas in my time today I'm going to show you how to make a watermelon old-fashioned cocktail. One day while working an Ice Cube and others rap concert at the Orleans Arena a brother being funny came up and asked me man how about a watermelon cocktail. I turned around grabbed my trusty cocktail shaker and filled it with ice. Then I got one ounce of strawberry liqueur. Then I got one ounce of vodka and you know what my favorite is. Then I put in a dash of Cointreau. Then I got a dash of lime juice. Then I put in one ounce of orange juice. Then I shook it up real good and poured into an ice filled glass and gave it to him. Old boy didn't know that a lot of y'all that know Dr. Harry know, a many of people have had to spend the night sleeping, in the car in the parking lot after trying to be funny with Dr. Harry. See what Dr. Harry knew is this watermelon cocktail is a crowd pleaser observes Brian Katapong, beverage manager of Magnus on Water in Biddeford, Maine. If you throw anything in with watermelon, people will, order it. The vivid pink watermelon drink has broad appeal, at least in part because everyone knows what to expect from a cocktail flavored with a fruit most associated with pleasant, sun-soaked summer vibes. The watermelon margarita, for instance, remains a quintessential example of the pop cocktail, easy on the eyes, and not too much of any one thing. But how exactly did watermelon become a shortcut to pleasing a crowd? While watermelon brandy, distilled across the low country of South Carolina in the 1800s, shouldn't be overlooked, watermelon drinks weren't part of the classic cocktail canon, or mid-century tiki culture either. Watermelon was never a thing in tiki drinks, says Jeff Beachbum Berry, tiki historian and owner of New Orleans Latitude 29. Or any drinks I know of pre-cocktail renaissance, he adds, except for pouring vodka into a whole melon via a drilled hole at 1970s barbecues. Young brother no, now.